Hi, good afternoon. I'm Ian and I'm one of the founders of Countryside Valley. Hi, I'm Daniel uh, Birrell and uh, I'm one of the founders of Countryside Valley. So back in April, uh, the general license was revoked quite suddenly and Daniel and I were wondering what to do uh, the following Saturday as busy shooting came back. So we decided to uh, put quite a funny sale, why don't we march in love with it on Saturday? Um, that's where it started. And from there we sort of we, we decided to build up a Facebook group and uh, it, it, within a sort of like a few, a few weeks the number was really, really climbed. Um, so really you know, it was quite exciting and then uh, we came down into London and we met each other for the first time. Um, decided in the Fort of South Wales to organise a rally. Um, with that then uh, we got in contact with all the people that have done previous rallies in, in, the, in the past. Um, we spoke to the police, the police gave us a, a nice route and they've been really good. They have. So the whole purpose really was we started off with you know, general licence but then it became a much bigger subject of the group. So we actually started up the rally to unite the countryside and it was really about bringing you know, the general licence that was uh, as effective farming, shooting and it affected a lot more, a much far more impact than people thought. So we thought actually there's an opportunity here. We had you know, conservationists getting in touch saying you know, they're worried about the, you know, the drop in songbirds because you know, magpies couldn't be moved and it grew and grew and grew. So we said okay let's move the rally, we'll put it into June, um, 29th of June and we start at Speaker's Corner and we walked down towards Westminster and it was really about starting to turn the table and getting public support uh, for the countryside. You know, there's a lot of misinformation out there, um, there's a lot of apathy from you know, the shooting uh, you know, community. So we wanted to do something positive, take action and be a voice for change. So that's where it all started from. Uh, we met on a rather warm day on a Saturday at Speaker's Corner. Um, wonderful turnout, we've got pe people from all, all walks of life, from you know, Borders down to Somerset, Suffolk, Yorkshire, fantastic turnout. We'd have liked a few more people, but do you know what? In two months, it's been an amazing achievement. We had a lovely walk through London, through some of the, you know, the highlights of London. Um, very peaceful, the police were absolutely fantastic. And yeah, we've ended up here just outside Downing Street. Um, really positive, and we've got this really good core community now of people that are really motivated to you know, really make a difference in the countryside and you know, be a force for change. You know, we can't just sit back and let things continue to happen to us. We've got a Facebook group at the moment, which is Countryside Rally 2019. I mean, that, that's still going to be around for a little while, but we'll update that. Um, but the next thing over the next few weeks is we're going to start we've got a, uh, plans for a website. Once that website goes live, we'll start we'll obviously share that on the, uh, the Rally Facebook group. And that's the start of this now becoming a, a, you know, a bigger event. The rally will just the start to create that momentum. Uh, so in a few weeks' time, we'll have the website up and running, um, and then people will find out far more information from there.